sounds nice that you don't set the angels in your life. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. If we think we need to powwow, if anybody finds something and you need backup, call one of the other teams. Mm -hmm. Obviously, you two teams can be a quicker response. We're going to be an hour away. Does anybody have any questions? Um, I just want to reiterate uh, our commitment to not doing anything illegally. Mm -hmm. um, the only thing I'm concerned about really is, is that if we get in the unfortunate situation where we see a wolf in a trap, all we can do is video it. Um, hunters, you know, be listening uh, for uh, predator calls. They cannot hunt until a half hour before sunset. So I think that's about seven, or I'm not sure though. Um, half an hour before, half an hour after, those are the shooting. Yeah, predator calls sound like a dying rabbit. That kind of sound. Uh, they might do, they might be doing howling. Um, I'd say investigate any vehicle that might be on the road, but at the same time, don't like invest all your energy by like going down a trail if you just see a vehicle, but you don't know anything about it. Cause that could just be your whole morning gone for a guy who's hiking or something. So what I'm thinking is, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing he might have went down an ATV trail, in which case all we can do is maybe put a trail camera there, see when he comes back. I feel like those are his tracks right there. Though. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, they're going to be leading somewhere. Yeah, right. Okay, do they fill this way, right? Oh, right there. Good evening. Sorry, I didn't need to startle you. <laughs> Where are you guys from? Been just traveling around a lot. I'm oh. not really from anywhere. Oh, okay. At least I haven't been in two years. So Southern? Yeah. Whereabouts? Oshkosh. Okay. Yeah. I lived for a while in Wisconsin Rapids. Oh, cool. So I've been down in that neck of the woods. So. Yeah. Nice. Actually, I'm, I'm setting, if you guys are still wondering what I'm doing, I'm setting traps. Oh, okay. So our, our wolf season for Wisconsin opened today. Yeah, over there. Oh, yeah, yeah, I definitely smelled something. Yeah. Right? <laughs> it's this stuff. It's called, it's called gusto, and it's just a real, real stinky, stinky lure. So you, you place your trap in about 12 inches in front of your trap. You just make a little a little hole in the ground, and then you just uh, dip some sticks in here, and then put that in the ground. Mm -hmm. And it's just, and it's an attractant. And, and so they, they're like... Well, they think there's something dead. So this, underneath that dirt, is where there's a foothold trap. And we think the rock marks it. Is that can be shown. Yeah. See how it looks like it's been picked up? There's a really, really skunky smell that he left. And the dirt is kind of, I mean, it's barely disturbed, but you can see yeah. the grass is smashed down. But yeah, you would never know. <laughs> Yeah. He, he said he's been setting traps all day. Like he took off of work today to do this. He's very excited and really friendly. Oh, he pointed but out that like today is the biggest day for wolf hunters to to be setting their traps and getting everything ready. He said it's gonna fill up quick. <laughs> yeah, four to five miles that way west. He's got um, his friend also set traps. Okay, so, where are we We're setting this thing up? This tree. Uh huh. Right here. The big one? Is, yeah, it's like the. Because here's the, the trap. Best angle. You don't. Okay, let's not get close to it. No, we're. Because we can put our scent on it. Hey, Joe. So, 
to found a wolf trap. It's about 20 feet that way. We're gonna go ahead and set up our trail camera. See if we can catch an image in case he catches a wolf tonight. He's uh, setting the trap, it's dusk. Uh, we know that he's set the other traps four miles from here. He's been very friendly. Talking to our crew, letting us know what he's up to. And we intend to be just as friendly back, but we will document what he's doing and use it however we can to stop the hunt. Yep, it's still there. I mean, the, the camera is. All right, I'm going to be checking to see the location of the trap. It is still in the ground. October 19th, 6.51, 20 minutes after the close of the season. And this is a trap that we saw a wolf trapper explain to us was a wolf trap and placed in the ground. It's still in the ground, intended to catch a, a wolf. This is illegal trapping. So what we've been doing is placing a trail camera to capture images, to document that he has not been checking his trap every 24 hours as was required by law. Another example of dirty trapping. I'm gonna activate the camera, and capture video images. Yep. Good. Good. You know, we put that first. We don't get paid for our work. Mm -hmm. And I think all of that people see when we're out here doing this. Yeah. And so I guess what I'm saying is that I want to be I want to nurture unity and, and try to navigate these differences between people because out of it might come a new form of activism. You think you heard a howl? You want me to throw out a howl on the howler? Did you Why not? Hear that yeah. Huh? I was yeah. kind of like, it was it kind of the airplane. I hope I have the boost that I'll like 